Hi, this is Gary with MacMost Now. Well, this Friday, Snow Leopard will finally be out. Let's go ahead and take a look at the top 10 reasons to upgrade to Snow Leopard. So Snow Leopard is the complete upgrade to Leopard, but without any new features. Well, that's not totally true. There are some new features, but it isn't as feature rich as most updates. That's because Apple spent most of its time rewriting the underlying OS software. So you're going to get lots of different things like speed increases and all of that, but you're not going to get many new features. So why should you upgrade? Well, reason number one is you're going to get back a lot of space. That's right, a lot of applications that are built into Mac OS X, things like Mail and Safari and all that, are specifically built for Intel-only machines, which means they don't have all the code overhead of being able to run on G3, G4, and G5 machines. And they've also been optimized. So these applications are actually going to shrink in size. So you're going to actually get space back on your hard drive when you install Snow Leopard over Leopard. So reason number two is QuickTime X or QuickTime 10. This new version of QuickTime is actually much more similar to QuickTime Pro in previous versions of Mac OS X. So you've got all sorts of cool features like the ability to record directly off your camera or off your microphone. You can also trim and edit videos. It's got a whole new interface. It can stream all sorts of different formats. You can do all sorts of cool things. It can even do video screen captures. You can record video of your screen just using QuickTime X. So this is a very big upgrade for QuickTime and it's reason enough to want to upgrade to Snow Leopard. So reason number three is that Snow Leopard will wake up from sleep and shut down faster than previous versions of Mac OS X. Now, if you have a MacBook and you travel a lot, you know how important those seconds are when moving around with your MacBook. So having Snow Leopard do that quicker will make your life a little bit better. So reason number four is for people that work in a more corporate environment and use Microsoft Exchange. Mac OS X Snow Leopard includes support for Exchange. That's support in Mail, iCal, and Address Book. It's interesting that Mac will be the only computer that actually supports Exchange out of the box. That's right, Windows users actually have to upgrade to have Outlook to be able to support Exchange. So reason number five is another reason for travelers. You take your MacBook to a different time zone and you notice only a few days later that your MacBook still has the time from where you live. And this might throw off your iCal events, may throw off your meeting schedules, all sorts of things. But Mac OS X Snow Leopard will actually recognize that the Wi-Fi you're connected to is on a different network in a different time zone and correct the time. It's a very useful feature for travelers. So reason number six is for people that use Exposé and Stacks, which are most of us. These features are useful already, but they're even more useful in Snow Leopard. Exposé activates from the dock if you wanted to and also presents a cleaner grid and Stacks are now scrollable. Reason number seven are for those of us that are all thumbs when typing on a keyboard. Snow Leopard will actually replace text that you type wrong. Now this automatically happens in applications like Microsoft Word, but now it will happen system-wide, which means your mistakes like spelling the, T-E-H, can be auto-corrected throughout all the basic Mac OS X applications and third-party developers can access this and incorporate it into their own applications as well. Now reason number eight is you should upgrade to Snow Leopard because it's the same as Leopard. Now this may seem a little strange, but think about it. One of the reasons people don't upgrade software or upgrade their OS is because they don't have time to learn something new. But since Snow Leopard is basically the same interface as Leopard, you don't have to learn anything new. You can start using it right away. Now reason number nine to upgrade is that Snow Leopard is cheap. It's only 29 bucks to upgrade. Now if it was more than $100, you can kind of make the excuse, oh I don't have the money right now. But you've already spent probably more than $1,000 on your Mac. You might as well have it running the most up-to-date operating system. It's a cheap upgrade, so go ahead and do it. And the final reason, reason number 10 to upgrade to Snow Leopard, is the fact that this is the future. If you want to take advantage of all the new features and all the different things coming out, not only from Apple, but from third-party software vendors, you're going to need Snow Leopard. So if you have an Intel-based Mac, you really should go and take the time to upgrade to Snow Leopard so you can move forward with it. Hope you liked my look at the top 10 reasons I think to upgrade to Snow Leopard. Now, got a big announcement coming at the end of the week that involves Snow Leopard and Mac most, so stay tuned for that. And of course, as soon as Snow Leopard comes out, I'll be covering some of these features directly in individual episodes. Till next time, this is Gary Rosenzweig with Mac Most Now. <music>